Four students at one Miami-Dade high school are heading back to class this morning after a stabbing outside their school. This morning, three teens are hurt and one is under arrest. But among the questions this morning, why were the stabbing victims at the school in the first place? CBS 4's Riel Creighton is live in West Kendall with the latest. Riel. Good morning, Lauren and Mary Bell. We have learned that the three teens who were stabbed here at the school are not students in Verola High School. We've learned that the teen accused of doing the stabbing is. Now, what led up to that attack is still unclear. <laughs> Police sirens echoed in the streets around Felix Verola High School in West Kendall Monday. During a downpour after dismissal, when a student stabbed three others with a knife. Parent says he's concerned for the safety of his ninth grade son. He lives nearby and he walks to the to the house every day. That's why I'm here to see what the school is going to do, what the the county is going to do to prevent this type of situation. Miami Dade Schools Police Chief Edwin Lopez says police were able to catch the student quickly and charge him with possession of a weapon on school grounds. The officer was at uh, was nearby, was able to call for assistance and respond to the scene and quickly put. Uh, the the uh, or appre actually apprehend the suspect. It's unclear what led to the violent confrontation as more than 2,000 students, parents, and teachers were leaving the school. That's still under investigation at the current time. However, uh, the, it is confirmed that detectives in the preliminary investigation that all parties involved did know who uh, one another were. Police say the three teens approached the Varela student who was sitting in his car. There was an altercation, and the student in the car stabbed the three teens. The chief says since they started the fight, they are now facing charges of battery and burglary. The chief confirmed the three are not students at Varela. He also says investigating this wasn't easy. We've been dealing with, with tumultuous weather uh, all afternoon, which didn't assist in the part of the investigation. Lopez says there will be extra officers at the school today just to be safe, which is a step in the right direction for at least one parent. I don't want my son to, uh, my, my son, to have, kind of have anything happening to my son. Well, the three who were stabbed, we've learned, are recovering and are stable. We're live in West Kendall, Riel Creighton, CBS 4 This Morning.